Und sehen Sie sich die Freude an von Stefan Edberg. Der Schwede gewinnt dieses Finale von Indian Wells. In vier Sätzen mit 6 zu 4, 5 zu 7, 7 zu 6 und 7 zu 6. Muster effortlessly reaches match point and wins 6-1, 6-3, 6-1, reversing his defeat in the Monte Carlo final to Chesnikov earlier this month. And on this irrepressible form, the Austrian will have the top seeds worrying at next week's French Open at Roland Garros. ai danni di Stefan Edber e sfonda Becker col rovescio è di nuovo il vincitore del torneo di Stoccolma 6-4, 6-0, 6-3 un'ora e 49 minuti ist der Weltmeister im Tennis bei den Herren 1990. Glückwunsch von hier.
Voilà. Je chaîne le public est debout pour encourager cet Espagnol de 20 ans, Sergi Bruguera. Und Match für Guy Forger, der diese Woche krönt mit dem Turniersieg, mit dem Erfolg über Pete Sampras. 170.000 Dollar an Preisgeld einstreicht. Set match muster. Six two, six one, six two. Four, five, six, four. Six seven, six four, six seven. Then the match muster. Five seven, six four, six one. Ed è con un servizio vincente che Boris Baker si aggiudica l'incontro con il punteggio di 7-6, 6-3, 3-6, 6-3. He'll shake hands.
Defensiv Stief. 6-4, And his first time here in Hamburg, Andre Medvedev takes the title. And with that conclusive serve and smash, Pete Sampras justifiably wins the 1994 Italian Open. Yeah. 
sete matchs. Agassi, 4 matchs à 1. 6-1, Ed è gioco partita in contro per Thomas Muster che con il punteggio di 3-6, 7-6, 6-2, 6-3 in 2 ore e 51 minuti. Standing ovation. And there it is, and he will be absolutely delighted. He's proved beyond all doubt that he can play indoors as well as outdoors on the slow clay. Je Ed è tutti in piedi a salutare questa vittoria meritatissima di Thomas Muster che è davvero felice di aver risolto dopo tre...
Sampras. Three six seven six seven six six seven six four. Made it look easy. Andre Medvedev with his third German Open Championship over the last four years. What a way to finish it, Joel, with another winner up the line, smoking forehand. Those kicker wide. And there good. it is. The Italian Open belongs to the 23-year-old native of Barcelona, Alex Carecha. Spiel Satz und Sieg, Korda, 7, 6, 6, 2, 6, 4, 7, 6, 6, 2, 6, 4. Sieger der Eurocard Open 1997, Petre Korda. Set match, Sampras, from our chain, 6 3, 4, 6, 6 3, 6 1.
for $361,000. Congratulations. Er wird nicht weiterspielen, höre ich gerade. He doesn't continue, sagt Rudi Berger. Und die beiden umarmen sich, ein schönes Bild. Ich glaube, dass es in diesem Falle, auch wenn die Zuschauer pfeifen, eine vernünftige Entscheidung sind, denn da könnte vielleicht mehr passieren. Satz und Sieg, Koretscha. 3-6, 3-6, 7-5, 6-3, 7-5. 3-6, 3-6, 7-5, 6-3, 7-5. 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5, 7 win over Thomas Engfist in the semis. And an ace for the championship. Richard Krejcik's 24th ace. What a way to finish for the big Dutchman. And a great performance by the diminutive by comparison Frenchman Sebastien Grosjean from Marseille who had himself quite a tournament. Je sette match à Quarten. 6 4 de Du Prince qui récompense le vainqueur depuis plusieurs années. Spiel, Sats and Sieg, Rios. Sex even. Seven for him. Seven, seven sex, sex line.
la partita 0, 6, 4, 7, 5, 7, 6, 4, 6, 4, Jeune, 7 matchs, Agassiz. 7, 6, 6, 2, 4, 6, 6, 4. Spiel, Zat und Sieg, Sampras. 6, 1, 7, 5, 6, 4. 6, 1, 7, 5, 6, 4. Sampras who takes the acclamation six, one, as he becomes six, the first man seven, seven, ever seven, to win seven. 11 Masters Series titles. Series title for Marat Safin. I, for one, will be amazed if it's his last. Game set match interest 7 6 6 4. is a great win for Wayne Ferreira. Four hours and 11 minutes, and in the autumn of his career, Wayne Ferreira revives his career. Just at the match, Safin. 3-6, 10-6, this cut, 
Cecis. Masterclass from the maestro. Jan-Michael Gamble along with Andy Roddick and Marty Fish and Taylor Dent may represent the future of American tennis. But Andre Agassi is American tennis. Reserve set match. Clinton. Cease twice. Cease there. Cease cap. It's out, and Portas cannot believe it. 4-6, A standing ovation. It's the first Masters Series title on hard court for Gustavo Kurt. An overwhelming performance. Rafter on the day, totally outplayed. Disappointment for Patrick. Last three tournaments. Stay 
problem with my leg, uh, with my muscle and I'm very sorry that uh, I couldn't play you know, this final but uh, that's the tennis life and it uh, sometimes happens, you know. But that's a pity for me that I couldn't play because uh, it was my first, uh, you know, the Tennis Master Series final and especially against the Andre Agassi, you know, so it was big motivation for me to play but uh, I couldn't play. Set the match, Hewitt wins by two sets to none. Six one, six one. Championship point. Oh. And he's done it. And what a lovely scene.
And that's it. He's done it. Absolute joy on Henman's face. Game seven. And great that he should finish with an ace. Six 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 Roger Federer is the Tennis Masters Cup champion 2003. The game set match. Federer. 6-3, Love, 14. You stopping? Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Correa has to retire the match due to Indira. Game set the match, and Rodic, 6-7, 6-3, 6-1. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2004 NASDAQ 100 Open champion, Andy Roddick. And that's it. So a delighted Correa achieving this year what he just failed to do last. Gioco partita incontro Moya. 6-3, And prolonged applause for a quite magnificent comeback by the world number one. At last, the new issue. Federer wins by two sets of us. <laughs> six three, six two. Just sublime. The best player of the year, the best player of the modern era, perhaps the best player of all time. We shall see. Championship points. Game, set the match. Roger Federer. Federer wins by three sets to that. 6 2, 6 4, 6 4. And rather appropriate, I think, that an ace is 14th of the day, should close it out.
two six six seven seven six six three six one. Well, they fall into each other's arms at the end of a quite magnificent scrap. So nearly won by Nadal. shake hands at the net after a tremendous battle which has established this young man Again. well it's all over Better.
his fifth victory in six meetings with the world number one and his third this season. <laughs> well, there's no doubt about the fact that he got a little tense on that match point. And there's also no doubt about the fact that he is absolutely delighted. He's done it. Federer delighted, I'm sure, to add to his Masters Series tally. He's done it. His 21st ATP title, and amazingly, the first of the 2006 season. And he's done it in a place that he calls his second home. A two-time champion here now, and he thoroughly deserved his victory. That's it. That's done. Three championship points. Well, it was a privilege to witness. He's done it. It's been a long time coming. The victory snaps a 12 tournament losing streak, dating back to the French Open last season. A seventh Masters Series Shield for the world number two and his fifth different Masters Series title. He's done it. Delight for mum and dad. Disappointment for Kanyas. But it's a career-defining moment for the 19-year-old from Belgrade. He gets his hands on his very first ATP Masters Series Shield. He's done it. Nadal successfully defends his title. And becomes only the second player in the Open Era to win a hat-trick of titles here. He's done it. Waterford Crystal Masters Series Shield, his third of the season after wins in Indian Wells and Monte Carlo. He's done it.
Foley deserves his win. The streak of 81 consecutive matches on clay has come to an end. He's done it. And what a way to do so. A second Waterford Crystal Masters Series shield for the young Serb after earlier success in Miami this season. That'll do it. The perfect end to a very competent match. A 14th Masters Series shield for the top seed and world number one. His fifth title of the year and amazingly the 50th ATP title of his illustrious career. He's done it. A magnificent match by Nalbandian. He's done it. And in the end, it was a comfortable victory. The second time he's been able to beat Nadal in as many Masters Series events. And what a way to finish, not only the match, but also another stunning season. He's done it. Okay, set match, Djokovic, 2 set four, 6 2, 5 7, 6 3. His third ATP Masters Series shield. He's done it. Game, set match. David Enko, two sets to love. Six four, six two. series title and his very first here in Rome. He's done it. A phenomenal effort from Nadal. The 11th Masters Series title of his career equal now with the great Pete Sampras. He's done it. Game, set, match, no doubt. A 12 six, three, Master six, Series shield for the Spaniard. He's done it! A career-defining moment for the British number one.
an emotional moment. Successive Masters Series Shield after victory in Cincinnati. He's done it! Songa sparks pandemonium in Paris. A career defining moment for the Frenchman. His very first Masters Series Shield. And he becomes the first Frenchman to win here since Sebastian Grosjean back in 2001. And there it is. It was a very accomplished performance this afternoon. Faltered ever so slightly in that second set. He's done it. Yeah, so much. Nadal. 6 1, 6 2. A second title here in Indian Wells after his earlier success in 2007. A 13th Masters Series shield for the Spaniard. He's now just one behind the great Roger Federer. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2009 Sony Ericsson Open champion, Andy Murray. He's done it. The king of play still reigns here in the Principality. Here's Murray at match point. And that'll do it. A little bit of an anti climax at the end. But Murray wraps up a comfortable win in that third set to win his fourth Masters Series 1000 title. And of course, his second this season after earlier success in Miami. Federer's third victory here in Cincinnati in the 16th Masters Series 1000 title of his career. Takes him one ahead of his great rival, Rafael Nadal.
He's done it. And that's how much it means to him. His first Masters Series 1000 title of the year after coming so close in Miami, Monte Carlo, Rome and Cincinnati. That's fantastic stuff from Lubitsch. What an incredible story. What a phenomenal tournament he has had. A career-defining moment at 31 years of age. His sixth successive Monte Carlo title. Nobody has done that before in the Open Era. Nadal is the champion in Rome once more. It's a five-timer for him here now in the Eternal City. That ties him at 17 Masters 1000 events. That's a record. He's done it. Victory for Murray. The first time in his career he's been able to beat Federer in a final. So a career-defining moment. Federer wins. Better match, better on. It is indeed his 17th Masters Series six, 1000 six, title. Seven, six, six, four. He now ties Agassi and is just one behind the all time leader, Nadal. He's done it in style. Robin Sonling becomes a Masters 1000 champion for the very first time in his career. Following in the footsteps of other great Swedes like Stefan Edberg and of course Thomas Inquist here in 1996.
two sets to one. Four six. Six three is six two. Novak Djokovic is your champion here, and for the moment, you'd have to say he's the best player in the world. He's done it. And what a victory. The seventh Masters Series 1000 title of his career. Feet. Maybe one that we'll never see again. Who knows? Seven successive. in the best possible fashion in straight sets. He's done enough. And indeed he has a comfortable victory in the end for Murray. He's done it. Federer wins in Bercy for the very first time in his career. It's the 18th Masters 1000 title for him. Victory for Federer. 6-3, 6-7, 6-3. And he becomes the first ever six-time champion at the season-ending finale. Okay, second match. Roger 
Federer has become a four-time champion of the BNP Paribas Open. The first man ever to do so. champion in the principality if ever a player had ownership of an event it is Rafael Nadal it's the subtle return of serve that gets the job done for Federer a record equaling 20th ATP Masters Series 1000 title in the European Spring and wins here in Rome for a sixth time. He's done it. Victory for Djokovic. Two sets to that. Six three. Six two. His twelfth Masters Series 1000 title. Roger Federer stands alone in Cincinnati, the first ever five-time champion in the Open Era of this event. He's done it. Victory for Djokovic. His first title here in Shanghai. success in 2009. It's the ninth ATP Masters Series 1000 title of his career. Novak Djokovic reigns in Monte Carlo. He ends Rafa Nadal's eight-year hold on this tournament. Masters 1000 title. He's done it. 
A smile of delight on the face of Nadal. A 24 ATP Masters Series 1000 title. His love affair with China continues. His seventh tournament win here. Novak Djokovic is the Paris champion for the second time in his career. The 2014 champion here in Madrid is Rafa Nadal. What a victory, what a tournament for the Frenchman, the first time ever in his career that he's been able to beat four top ten players at a single event. Oh, what happened? 
evening, Nick. And this is one millimetre out. And Federer makes it six in Cincinnati. He wins a 22nd Masters 1000 title. for Federer, the 23rd Masters Series 1000 title of his career. Novak Djokovic becomes the first player ever to defend the BMP Paribas Masters. Unfortunately, I'm not match fit, I can't compete. Congrats, of course, to Novak, who's played uh, an amazing season. That's a proud moment. It's his fourth title here at the year end championships, a seventh victory this season, and the 48th title of his illustrious career. Yeah, Djokovic has done it. Djokovic. He has successfully defended his title here at the BMP Paribas Open, beating Roger Federer in the final for the second consecutive year. For Murray, a famous victory, his first against Nadal on clay. It's title number four in Rome for Novak Djokovic. He wins a fifth Masters title on the belts. A quite sensational week from the now world number two. He denies Djokovic once again. The weights will continue for the world number one here. That'll do it. A famous victory for Novak Djokovic. His 25th Masters 1000 title. Just missed it. Djokovic defends. He's the champion once more in Paris. A record fourth title here in Bercy. And the world number one becomes the first player ever to win six Masters 1000s in the very same season. Game set match. Mr. Federer challenging the call. Right side is line. Ball was called. Out. Game oh, he's missed it. Always a disappointing way to end such an important match. But in the end, it's delight for Djokovic. He was simply too good this evening for Federer. Here's Djokovic with championship points. Game set match. Djokovic. 
2016 BMP Panabar Open champion. Novak Djokovic wins a record breaking 28th Masters 1000 title. And for a third straight year, it's the Sunshine Double. wins a ninth title in Monte Carlo. He snaps a two-year barren run. For just the second time in his career, Novak Djokovic is the champion in Madrid. He notches up a 29th Masters 1000 title. He's done it! And what a way to win the title here! Becomes the first British winner here in Rome in the Open Era. And Novak Djokovic becomes the Rogers Cup champion for the fourth time in his illustrious career. a way to seal victory. Maran Cilic wins his very first Masters 1000 title. across Andy Murray's face as he wins here in Shanghai for the third time in his career. Andy Murray is the champion here in Paris for the very first time. It's the eighth trophy of the season for Murray and his 14th Masters 1000 and of course tomorrow he will become the new world number one. He is king of the world right now. He's champion of the Barclays ATP World Tour Finals. And he's created history by becoming only the 17th player in the history of the game to be crowned year-end world number one.
wins a fifth title in Madrid. A 30th Masters 1000, proud of his career. It was one of the matches of the season so far. Alexander Zverev Jr. is a Masters 1000 champion. His first title coming here in Rome. Zverev is the champion in Montreal. He is no longer a next-gen hope. He is taking his place at the absolute top of the game. Claims his first Masters 1000 title of his career. He caps a stunning week. He didn't lose a single set here in Cincinnati. And what a warm embrace that is. It's a return to the world's top ten for the Bulgarian. Roger Federer is the Shanghai Rolex Masters champion for a second time. For a fifth time in a row, he gets the better of his great rival. And wins title number 94. Qualifies Five, seven, for the NITO ATP six, World Tour finals in London. What a day of tennis for the likeable American. Juan Martín Del Potro is a Masters 1000 champion for the first time in his career. He did it the hard way, saving three championship points along the way. He becomes the first Argentine ever to win here in Indian Wells. John Isner is a Masters 1000 champion for the very first time. How fitting in our last ever visit to Key Biscayne. It's an American that takes the spoils. The biggest title in his career by some distance. For a fifth time here. Luego, Alexander Zverev sweeps all before him in Madrid. The 21 year old German claims a third Masters 1000 title of his career. He finishes in the most spectacular manner 
to win his eighth title in Rome. It's a 30-second Masters 1000 title for the Spaniard. Rafa rules in Toronto his fourth Rogers Cup title, the fifth trophy of 2018, and his 33rd Masters 1000 crown. A fabulous battle. History is made in Cincinnati. Novak Djokovic becomes the first man in singles to capture all nine Masters 1000 titles. It's the Golden Masters sealed in America's Midwest. Koric is a challenge to call until left baseline ball was pulled out. Novak Djokovic is the Rolex Shanghai Masters champion for a fourth time. His love affair with China continues. are most definitely coming on the ATP World Tour. Grabs the biggest title of his young career. Dominic Team wins the very first Masters 1000 title of his career. He's the champion in Indian Wells, and it will be a day he will remember for the rest of his life. He's got the better of Roger Federer in one of the biggest finals of the sport. And boy, did he deserve it. It is. Masterful in the Magic City once more. For the fourth time, Roger Federer is champion in Miami as he picks up title number 101. Fabio Fanini is a Masters 1000 champion. He can barely believe it. He is the first Italian to win here in Monte Carlo since 1968. It's Djokovic who dominates on the dirt. It's another milestone victory here in Madrid as the world number one picks up his 33rd Masters 1000 title. It ties in with Rafael Nadal as the most ever. It's 
the ninth title for Rafa in Rome and a record-breaking 34th Masters 1000 trophy for the Spaniard. He ends his weights for a first title this season and it's come at the perfect time. Nadal is the champion in Canada once more. A 35th Masters 1000 trophy for the Spaniards. On the doorstep of glory. How you like me now, says Medvedev. And a new king will be crowned in the Queen City. But the coronation commence for Daniil Medvedev as he picks up his first Masters 1000 title. Well, it's been a Medvedev masterclass again this week. It's the second consecutive Masters 1000 title for the Russian. After winning in Cincinnati a few months ago, he is now one here in Shanghai without dropping a set. It is a fifth Rolex Parish Masters title for Novak Djokovic. And a 34th Masters trophy in total. Stefanos Tsitsipas is the 2019 NITO ATP Finals champion. And he's the first ever Greek champion in the history of the season-ending championships. It's the fourth title of his career, but easily the biggest. What a day 